Hello YouTube and Facebook people. Welcome back to my videos. Today is another haul. Obviously, that's all I do on my channel. Um, this one is from the Colorado Springs Goodwill Outlet, aka The Bins. And normally, me and Chad go on Saturday nights, but we haven't been having much luck. So, my mom's on spring break, so she went with me on a Wednesday, which was yesterday. And, yeah, I just wanted to see if anything was better during the weekdays. And it wasn't. <laughs> but, yeah, this is what we got. We were there for five and a half hours, which it felt like forever. <laughs> Um, and yeah, I ended up getting 29 and a half pounds and our bins, it's $1.29 a pound. So with tax, it ended up costing $41 and 20 cents. Um, not all of it's for Poshmark. Some of it's for family and me. <laughs> so yeah, here's what we got. Um, first thing is this boulder band. And this one just happens to be a Colorado one, which is where I'm from. But I don't know if these are popular outside of Colorado, just like the regular ones. I'm not sure. I mean, it's Boulder, Boulder, Colorado. I think that's where the company is. But yeah, I'm not sure if those are popular anywhere else. Um, if you buy this in the store, it's like $20 for a headband. I probably won't sell it on Poshmark. I'll give it to one of my nieces because they really like Boulder bands. So yeah, I'd rather go to them because I know they'll enjoy it. This I picked up for one of my nephews. It's the brand Rain Spooner. I don't know the brand, sorry, show it to you. Rain Spooner. And it's just this little tiny Hawaiian shirt. And it's so cute and I think my nephew, well he's young, he, he won't know what he's wearing, but he'll look cute in it. Um, this is for my brother. It's the brand Greg Norman Play Dry. And I'm not sure about this brand. I did a live video on my Facebook and my dad said it's a good brand. It's a golfing shirt. And my brothers go golfing a lot during the summertime. So I picked that up for him. This is Ann Taylor Petite um, uh, Factory, size four petite. Oh, sorry. And it's just this really cute midi length pencil skirt. It's just really pretty colors for spring and summer. These are for one of my nieces. It's an American Eagle, super low jagging, and it's a size zero. American Eagle. But anytime I find American Eagle in her size, I pick it up. Cause one, she likes American Eagle jeans. Two, they're expensive to buy brand new. And even if you buy them at a thrift store, they're still expensive, they're like $8. So to pick them up at the bins, you pay like, especially for her size. Sorry, <laughs> I just dropped a bunch of stuff. But even for her size, I mean, 75 cents maybe, because they're so light. Um, these are apartment nine. They are the relaxed crop and they're size 16. I picked these up for a friend. And yeah, it's just this cute pair. They almost look like a boyfriend style to me, but if they're not her size, then I'll put them up in my Poshmark closet. This again is for the same niece that likes American Eagle. She also likes the brand pink. And it's just this plain black thermal top. This one, I'm not sure if the brand does good anymore. I know to buy it retail, it's pretty expensive. And it's just the brand Life is Good, and it's a size extra large. But I really like, it says Happy Hour, and it's just a guy by the campfire with his dog drinking coffee. And it's like a mauve color, long sleeve shirt. And if the comps aren't any good, then I'll keep it for myself, because I really like oversized clothing. Um, this one is the North Face, size extra large, and it's just a men's uh, sweater, fleece sweater, North Face, and it's got a gray stripe going down it. It's in excellent condition. These my mom found, they are the brand 77, and it's a slim boot, and it's size 3030, and it's just this dark wash boot cut jean. Really good condition. 
Okay, yeah, my mom did good on those ones. I'm not sure where that brand is sold though. I see it a lot at regular Goodwill, but I'm not sure where it's sold. Um, this is a Nike dry fit, size large, running short. And I'm actually thinking about bundling or lotting all of my same size workout clothes in my posh closet just to move them out a little faster. My outdoorsy brands sell fast like Columbia, Patagonia, and North Face, but like Nike and Under Armour, it does take a little longer to sell for some reason. Um, these are Spanx Slim Straight and they're size 31. And I've never found Spanx at, well, anywhere actually, but I know Spanx new is expensive, so I'm hoping these do all right. They're in excellent condition. They don't feel like they've been worn at all. My mom found these. They are Zach and Rachel size eight, and I'm not sure where that brand is sold either, Zach and Rachel, but it is new with tags, and it's a slim ankle. That's the style. Just a pair of work pants. And they are navy blue. I don't know if I said that, but it's like a dark blue. Um, this one was going to be for me. I don't think I have any more vests. I gave them all away when I lost weight because not them fit me. But this one's an L.L. Bean size medium. And it's just like this mossy green zip up fleece. And I really liked it. And I like L.L. Bean. Like pretty much anything L.L. Bean is my style. This one I picked up for Chad. And it's the brand Obey, size extra large, and it's just this striped button-up shirt for when he wants to look a little nicer when we go out. We don't go out that often, but on the rare occasions that we do. This is the brand Cowgirl Hardware, and it's a size small, uh, um, kid small. I picked this up for one of my nieces. They do 4H. And yeah, it might be a little small, I'm not sure, but yeah, so when she does her presentations at 4-H, so she looks like a little cowgirl. <laughs> uh, my mom found this one, it's Liz Claiborne Extra Large Tall, I think that's what that means, XLT, and it's this sheer button-up, and it's got the elastic wrists, I just thought it was really cute. It's like a summery spring top, but without being the pastel colors. This was one of the nicer brands I found. I had trouble finding the tag last time. It's a crisscross straps. Here it is. It's a Club Monaco size two. And it's just this stripe longer. I don't know if it's a maxi. I don't know if it's long enough to be a maxi, but it is pretty long. Just a lightweight summery dress. This one was gonna be, oh yeah, this one was for me. <laughs> and I didn't realize it until just a little bit ago when I actually read the whole label. It's a Gilligan and O'Malley sleepwear, size medium. I didn't realize these were pajama pants. I just saw that they were gaucho pants, like gaucho shorts. So I picked them up for me because I've always wanted to try a pair. But even though they are sleepwear I'm still gonna wear them as regular pants I don't care I'm not a fancy person these I got for one of my nieces and these are really cute overalls and it's got the rolled ankle and a cute little lace belt and it's by 1989 place size 6 I don't know I've seen that brand a lot at the bins. Is it child's place, children's place? I don't know. But these are Vans, size 28. I picked these up for me, and I just now saw. They've got a little wear on the butt, but I might just iron a patch on the inside to keep it together. Like, I really don't care if I have holes in my clothes. But it's just like a pair of skater shorts my style I like boy clothes um, these are for a friend the same friend I was talking about earlier these ones are size 16 and they are an old uh, old Navy boyfriend short and it's got the rolled cuff 
and some patches and distressing. They're really cute. If these were my size, I would keep them because they're really cute. And again, if they don't fit her, I'll just put them in my um, Poshmark closet. These are for me. They're a Sonoma Slim Straight for Petite. Really dark wash. They look black, but it's a dark blue. Really good condition. Again, if they don't fit me, those will end up in my Poshmark closet. This I picked up for my sister, and it's an Exertion Slim Fit size medium. And it's just like a gray running pop over top. <laughs> These are a Levi's skinny size 12, kids 12. These are for my niece. My mom found this one. She's really good at finding Columbia stuff. Like, her eye is just drawn to it. Columbia size small, lightweight hiking shirt. And I like that it's like pastel -y colors and like even the buttons are purpley pastel. Really pretty. This is a loft size eight. And this is really, I don't know if you can tell it's kind of sheer, you can't tell, but it's light, lightweight, striped blazer. Perfect for in the office during summertime, so you don't get hot wearing it. My mom found these ones for me. The brand is Erica, and they're a size small petite. Like I've never seen that brand before. But it's just a pair of green, lightweight capris for the summertime. Oh, these are for my niece. There are they, Osh Kosh Bagosh, little overalls, and it's corduroy with little flowers on them. I thought those were so cute. Might be a little warm for summertime, but it's still cold here in Colorado, so there's still time to wear them. These are an Adidas size medium. And it's the older Adidas tag, but it's like a track pant, like the swishy sound, and it's got the jogger ankles with a zip. Really lightweight. This one is Columbia. My mom found this one too. Columbia, size large. And it's got the quarter zip pop over top, and it's burgundy with a blue stripe. Again, excellent condition. These ones are a Gap Sexy Boyfriend fit. They say size zero, but I'll show you in a second something kind of weird. So they're just a distressed skinny boyfriend. But then I also found these ones. So the Gap, they were meant for my posh closet. And then I found a pair of Old Navy Boyfriend and they're a size four regular. These ones were meant for me. And it's just a lightweight or a light wash color. But then I was comparing the size of them. And look, one of them's a size zero and one of them's a size four, but they're exactly the same laying flat. Kind of weird. So those both might be for me. Or if they don't fit, I guess both of them will not be for me and they'll go in my posh closet. Um, these are a pair of Columbia size 8 regular Omni Shade hiking pants. Um, cargo? Are they cargo? Yeah, cargo pants. Really lightweight for hiking. These I might keep for me for summertime. We like to go hiking a lot. And I don't think I have any hiking pants that fit. These are Banana Republic, size 6 Petite, and they are the Sloan. And it's just a pair. They're like khaki colored, but it's a thicker material. It kind of reminds me of the North Face hiking pants, like the thicker ones. Like, that's what it feels like. But yeah. I like the, uh, the feel of them. They feel like they're really well made. This one was going to be for me. I'll try it on. It's a Chico size 2, which is a medium, I think. I don't know. I don't have Chico size memorized. But it's got like the lace cuff right there and then the lace on the neck. And then it's just tunic length with lace there. 
And yeah, I think I said in my last video when I Marie Kondoed my house, I got rid of everything that was like dressed up because it didn't bring me joy. But I guess that doesn't matter because when you need to dress up, you just have to wear stuff that's uncomfortable and that's why. <laughs> that's being an adult. Uh, these are size, the brand is Forever 21, size 28. And it's just this really powdery blue, lightweight, like almost sheer, like you might have to wear a nude underwear with them. Um, skinny kind of, skinny leg, or it's tapered down. But I thought they were cute. Those would be good for the office too, if you needed to look nice, but you don't want to be hot, so you want to wear something light. These are a Lululemon size eight, and I love when they still have the tag in them. But it does have the little pocket, so if it didn't, and you don't know, in the waistband little pocket, they'll be there. And I'm not sure what the style is, but the bottoms, like there's the little sign. But on the backs, it does have the slits, and then the hem is like a wider fit. So, yeah. I don't know, I'll have to do some, some Googling to figure out the name of that style. And like I said, we were there for five and a half hours and I've only found one big name while we were there. This is Athleta size 38 D slash double D. And it's just a swimsuit top. It's got crisscross straps that are adjustable and it looks like leopard print. It's like a really dark blue and white. And it has the cross back with the keyhole in the back. It's really nice. Again, it was just the top. I didn't see a bottom, but I feel like people mix match tops and bottoms anyway. So that'll be an easy match, just blue bottoms. Um, this is a Columbia Extra Large. I believe it's women's. Really good condition. Like it feels brand new. And it's just their full zip sweatshirt. And it looked, I think it's a women's though, because it kind of has that taper in right there to define your waist. These again are Columbia. And I think I find so much Columbia because I do live in a mountainy area in Colorado. Um, size 10 and it's a corduroy bootleg. Good condition, no wear to them at all. Um, this is my pickle hat that I found. I absolutely love pickles. <laughs> so I saw this and I had to have it. And then I was reading inside, it's Rick and Morty, which I know is a cartoon. Like I didn't know that's, but yeah, I had some friends telling me that his name is Pickle Rick. <laughs> and I think I'm gonna give that to my cousin. He said he wanted it and he can have it. If he's gonna give it a good home, he can have it. He can have Rick. Um, these are New Balance size medium. And they're just a pair of full length, <laughs> two, they're really long, full length um, yoga pants or leggings. These were gonna be for me. I'm not sure about fit. They are loft size eight. Eight. I honestly don't know what size I am. I wear, I, I don't wear stuff that's too tight, but I definitely wear stuff that's too loose sometimes because I just like to be comfortable. But yeah, these are a size eight. If they don't fit me good enough, then I'll put them in my posh closet. They are linen, red, skinny leg, I guess, or slim fit maybe. But the color is really pretty. This is for my oldest brother, the PE teacher. I'm sure if you've watched any of my other haul videos, you've seen me pick stuff up for him. But that's just for him, for work. Whenever I find um, athletic wear in his size, I buy it. He's a PE teacher. I don't know if I said that, but he's a PE teacher, so his uniforms is exercise wear. Um, Eddie Bauer, size eight. Again, these were gonna be for me, and it's like a pair of capris with tie bottoms cargo pant and if not they'll go in my closet I might end up 
just lotting all of those size 8 capri type stuff together if they don't fit me just to get them out of my closet because I did buy them for me um, these are soft surrounding size 1x and it's just a plain black 100% cotton top it's fairly lightweight so yeah and that was everything I got in my haul um, normally me and Chad go to the Springs bins every Saturday sorry and then one Saturday a month we go up to Denver but I think we're gonna stop doing our weekly Springs bins because we're just not finding like really that good of stuff so Denver even Denver hasn't been that great for us. I know some people have really good luck in Denver, but honestly, I kind of feel like it's not that accurate. I think that some people actually shop at a lot of different places, and then when they do their hauls, they say it's from the Denver bins. That's my guess, because I've been there, and it's not the holy, the holy grail of thrift stores. It really isn't. But there is one, there's three Den um, three bins in Denver and we've been to two of them. So we are gonna try the one, the one more, the one that we haven't been to. Um, the one we regularly go to is the one that you probably see people hauling from on YouTube a lot. That's the one that we actually go to once a month. Um, but yeah, so you might not see a haul video for a while. Maybe I'll haul my death pile that's in my bedroom. Um, but yeah, that's it in the video. Feel free to look around in my Poshmark closet. It is at Bella Milk, and I will put that in the description down below. And yeah, I will see you in my next video. Bye.